G'day, how's it going? Saber SG here, and we're into EVE Online Series 23, Flying the Rupture. Doing a bit of solo PvP around Faction Warfare space. And, um, yeah, I quite like this ship, I'll be honest. I like it. But anyway, if you're enjoying the content, uh, please like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, yeah, let's get into the video. Alrighty, the rupture. Uh, quite enjoyed this ship, I've got to be honest. Uh, I've had this ship for a long time, I've just never used it, I had to skill into it. Um, I'm not really a Mimitar pilot, but I really like the look of having a medium newt uh, with the gun sort of set up and some drones as well. So we've got 180 cannons, the medium newt, two nano pumps, and a Trimark armor pump, web scram. Cap boosters, very cap hungry this fit. Um, requires a bit of management. Micro warp drive to get yourself into range quickly. Medium ancillary armor ripper and an armor ripper. Two multi spectrum energized membrane twos and a damage control. Uh, overall, I quite liked it. Uh, I think it brawls quite well. But uh, yeah. Let's get into some fights. Alright, so in this first fight, uh, my rupture is up against a battle augur. So, something very interesting. And uh, it ends up he's just like, he's got three medium newts, a couple light blasters, massive buffer, and some combat drains. And he's just muting the hell out of me. So it becomes a game of managing Cap and hopefully being able to DPS him down whilst managing my Cap uh, before, he's, before he kills me. Luckily his DPS isn't super high. Uh, the real danger is the muting, uh, hence killing my Cap. But yeah, super interesting fight. As you can see I'm capped out again. Pop that cap booster and then start repping my life. In hindsight, maybe I should have taken out um, his drones to, uh, you know, take away some of his DPS. But I was so transfixed on um, my cap. That, uh, that was just occupying all of my thoughts and time. <laughs> Trying to get some reps off. Like I said before, lucky his DPS is very low. And this fight does go for quite a while, but uh, as per the comments uh, in a previous video, people like to see the fights in real time rather than all sped up with loud music and stuff, so... I'm keeping it going in real time. So I'm gradually whittling him down. My DPS isn't that high either. Luckily, auto cannons don't require cap, so I can just I can always keep shooting. And obviously, drones don't require cap either. So even though I'm capped out, I'm still applying DPS, which is nice. Just about getting through his massive uh, shield buffer. It's a very interesting fit. There we go. Now he's starting to melt a bit. Cap that again. Just about into structure. And now I can activate the scram. Make sure he doesn't get away. And I rip up one more time. 
I don't know how many cat boosters I've gone through, but it's a quite a few. But, uh, yeah. Good fight, Mr. Coldstorm. Right, oh, so this next fight, uh, my rupture is up against Enya, and he was in the open, so I walked to the open, which is pretty dangerous because um, the rupture is fairly slow, so it's pretty susceptible to being kited. So when I walked in, uh, the first thing I wanted to do was to close range on him, and luckily that's exactly what he wanted to do as well. Um, he was a brawling fit, so so yeah. Uh, I don't know a great deal about the Enyo, other than that it's like a souped up Incursus Assault Frigate, I guess. But uh, yeah, mate, he does a lot of damage. So he's running a NOS, so even though my medium newt must be causing him a lot of problems, especially with his um, ancillary armor repair, he's got a NOS to at least be able to keep applying damage and keep his scram on me. And it ends up being a pretty intense fight. As you can see, his, his damage is quite high. I'm managing my cap, managing my reps, managing my heat. And uh, man, I'm nearly hitting structure. So uh, yeah, good fight, that was close. Alrighty, so after that Enyo fight, the same pilot comes back, uh, Mr. Harlock Ambril, uh, in a Vexa. Uh, so huge props to him because, um, mate, I love solo fights and the solo, um, like a 1v1 cruiser fight, mate, awesome, I love it. So big props to you, mate. But anyway, he ends up bringing a Vexa, a blaster Vexa, with the web scram and afterburner and uh, quite a lot of buffer tank. So in this case, even though I'm muting him, uh, my newts aren't really having much effect uh, because he's got a big buffer. I'm not turning off any active reps. So uh, yeah, he's dishing out uh, quite a lot of damage as you can see. And uh, I'm struggling for cap a bit. This, this fit is very cap hungry. So I'm going to pop that cap and get my tank going again. You can see it's a, mate, it's, it's a close fight. Things are not looking good. Alright, so I'm finally getting into a little bit of structure. Got my reps, come on reps. Super close. Uh, yeah, I managed to snag the win. Good fight, mate. Alright, so in this next fight, I am up against a Vexa once again. And a little word of warning that uh, this is a super, super long fight. Goes for ages. And uh, I really did, again, consider speeding this one up, but... Going by what people told me from our previous uh, comments and previous videos, they much prefer seeing stuff in real time, so I'm keeping it all real time. Here we go. But, um, so this was, um, this fight happened after a previous fight, so I'd already used a few cap boosters, um, which in the end there causes me problems. If I had a full cargo load of cap boosters, maybe things might have gone a little differently. But anyway. He is repping like a bastard. I'm repping like a bastard. And um, the both tanks seem to be doing quite well. Just trying to manage my cap, manage my heat, and then um, manage my reps as well.
Overall, I'm pretty impressed with the uh, rupture. Um, didn't really know too much about it, but I think having the newt there and guns, it does create a lot of pressure and drones. So when you're uh, fighting, your opponent's got to worry about the newting, he's got to worry about your DPS coming in, and he's also got to worry about the drones as well. Um, yeah, it's pretty cool. It is very cat hungry though. Drops his scram there. Maybe my new is uh, starting to do the trick a bit. Nope, scram is back. I think every time he um, pops his cap burst, he puts the scram back on me. He's uh, been taking out some of my drones, which I've been pretty slack on. I should get. Uh, I need to get a lot better at managing um, and keeping an eye on. DPS on my drones. Because uh, I'm only down to three now. So it's really turning out to be a battle of the cap boosters. Who's going to run out of cap boosters first? Because uh, once your cap boosters are gone, it uh, becomes a real hard job in uh, managing your tank. Luckily, uh, my guns and drones don't require that, but uh, he keeps killing my drones. So I'm down to two cap boosters left. That's why I like to have a little bit of inventory open on the side there. So. Um, I can keep an eye on things like the cat boost, so it gives me an idea of where I am in the fight. That panic is setting in a little bit because I know I've only got one cat booster left. <laughs> Getting in a sneaky reload on my um, ancillary armor wrapper there. It's almost reloaded. Pretty nice. Again, in hindsight, maybe I should have um, worked on taking out some of his drones a bit late now. Okay, I've got another cap booster, and I've got another full charge on my um, uh, Ansel. But I am now out of cap boosters, so problems, big problems. Oh boy, cap. Yes, I know, cap is a problem. Should have acted out of those reps a lot earlier then. It's probably what cost me the fight there. I'm into structure. I'm in big trouble. So I'm panicking at this stage. I forget to act out another reps. And uh, yeah. Props to him for a good fight. That was pretty awesome. Uh, yeah. Whoa, so there we go. That is the rupture. That was some long freaking fights, mate. But, um, yeah. Overall, I like it. I like the rupture. Medium newt, the auto cannons, drones. It's a good combo. Works quite well. And, um, well, if you're enjoying the content, if you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps me out a lot. And, uh, yeah, better, yeah, better, that's all, folks. Catch you in the next video. Cheers.